And also, uh, it's very peaceful. It's like anytime I'm with her, it's like I'm in a sanctuary. It's very peaceful. It's like anytime I'm with her, it's like I'm in a sanctuary. It's very peaceful. It's like anytime I'm with her, it's like I'm in a sanctuary. what's going on youtube is your boy ron back with another video before we get started make sure you please like comment subscribe all that good jazz on the road to 10,000 subs baby let's get it all right, so if you're new to the platform, please subscribe. OGs, I appreciate the love and support. Now, let's go ahead and jump into it. So today, I am going to be reacting to another interview um, that I was referring to um, from International Passport. I had recently reacted to the interview that he had with um, a black guy and a Latin woman. Come to find out that black guy is actually in the same group that I'm in in Facebook. Um, Think Smart Financials. That um, the admin is Skyler, and if y'all don't know who that is, he has a YouTube channel called One Master Teacher. Um, go check him out. Um, but I meant to um, react to this because I had brought it up and. I was able to find it, um, go ahead and save it to my list of ideas and finally got around to it because I've been trying to um, also get to you guys' um, suggestions and I actually got to look into my Instagram because um, somebody sent me another suggestion as well. All right. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into it. Interesting. So, um, Jim, what is it that you like so much about Caleb? You know, what is it that attracts you to him so much? It, it seems like you, you have great chemistry um, together. No. What, oh. so, yeah, why, what is it about him that you like so much, Jen? Uh, he's, of course, his appearance, but actually I don't care appearance too much. Um, but appearance can be a bonus, but um, his personality is really amazing. I haven't met before. Like his personality is like caring someone so much and then he's good at expressing his love and it's really kind and cute. <laughs> yeah, and sexy. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic. Uh, you win! Caleb, Caleb well, what, what do you like about Jin? What is it about Jin that attracts uh, to you, mm. yeah, so, he has you. So he's in awe. Um, when I first noticed about her is compared to where I come from, and then from meeting her, it's like so you know American girls they be like I'm mature. Nope. But they not really mature. They think they mature. Yeah. Mm. So the first conversation we had, I was able to really communicate as myself like i didn't have to act like someone i wasn't or do it really like the vibe so that's what got me going and then um also she's very caring and loving so anytime i'm going through something or a struggle she's always there to be my support and help me get through it so and also uh it's very peaceful. It's like Perfect. anytime I'm with her, it's like I'm in a sanctuary. You win. Where there's no drama, no extra stuff going on. It's just we can really communicate and connect with each other on a real deep and uh, loving level where there's nothing going on that's going to ruin that, you know? So it's Thanks. like. Mm. Wow. Did y'all hear that? Peaceful. She brings she he said whenever I'm with her it's like being in a sanctuary. <laughs> Fellas, tell me how that sound. Did that sound like something you can get in the states? Nope. 
slim pickings i know and this is what i'm saying bro like the women over there bro they just they just want to be treated right now you'll have women in the state say the same thing but they expect way more than that stop the cap they just say that to get you in the door get over here then they hit you with the bait and switch what the french toast nah we ain't going for that you ain't about to bamboozle me and you ain't finna finesse me and, and, and men are tired of it and that's why women are starting to panic because they they see men are waking up let's keep it moving that's pretty much what it was and then of course you know she's beautiful so Aww. so can we can we, we so obviously we want to date I, I want i want to have a korean girlfriend yeah you want to have korean girls right yes. you're interested in korean girls Yes. So, are, are, are they women? Are they good women to marry? Are they are they good women to date in Korea? In your opinion, Jin? Actually, I mean, it depends on like someone's personality, right? But at least <clears throat> I and like Korean woman is good at respecting men because it's our culture. Mm. Yeah, I don't know like the other countries' culture, but it's our culture, so we are good at respecting. And then, uh, also, Busan is like um, famous for beach, like beautiful beach. You know, like like yes. the sea. Yeah. So a lot of people, like, a lot of girls, is going to beach. And then, um, you can see the beautiful girls there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I want to stop right there because I, I, I want to touch on something that she brought up. She mentioned in our culture, you know what I mean, where we're taught to respect the men. And this is starting to become a word that I'm hearing a lot and I'm starting to understand why. What we're dealing with in this country, I don't. I don't think it's I don't think it's in I don't think it's no longer a, a economic issue as far as getting submission from a woman. I think it's a culture issue. I think it's because we've infused this strong independent don't need a man. Why you doing all that for him? Yeah, you know I mean, it's been infused into the culture and women have bought it hook line and sinker and it's backfiring on them and as usual, they're blaming men for it. Even though men didn't want shit to do with it. That's American culture for you. Let's keep it moving. I, I, I want to come to Korea and meet uh, a woman like you, Jen. Where can we find women like you in Korea, Jen? Because I want to have a girlfriend like you. Uh, that's a really hard question because, <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm always trying to be my, do my best uh, for everyone. So... Um, I don't know if you care about appearance, that woman appearance, then you can come to Busan. There are a lot of beautiful girls, and forward too. <laughs> so, but so, personality, uh, I don't know. I say, <laughs> uh, I say from my, uh, from what I've seen, from you know, uh, uh, friends on base, if you want. A more conservative and traditional Korean girl. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah they're like four characters. Right if you want a more uh, traditional and conservative, a conservative uh, Korean woman, then the country will be more for that. If you just want, you know, a really beautiful girl, then the big city like downtown Busan, um, Seoul. Cities like that, you'll find a beautiful Korean. But if you want like black material type, then more on the outskirts of the city because they still follow traditional values and things like that. So let me ask this, Jen. Um, you know what? That's interesting, man. Um, anybody um, that's that subscribed to my channel or watches my channel. Um, is there any truth to that? Because I think I've heard that from like other people that have been to the um, these Asian countries. Apparently, like in the city, you know what I mean. That's where you tend to find the more um, fun girls. And apparently, 
on the outskirts. I guess they call it provinces. Correct me if I'm wrong. But apparently that's where you find the more um, traditional minded women. Um, but yeah, let please confirm that in the comments, you guys. All right, let's keep it moving. I'm a black man. And oh. most people that watch my channel, they're all black men. Oh, um, really? Yes. Um, I, I'm black British, actually. You, you can tell by my accent. So I sound like Idris Elba or James Bond. I, do you know who they are? Oh. Do you know who James Bond is? And oh. Idris Elba? Or yeah. Michael B. Jordan? No, sorry. Idris Elba and, and uh, James Bond. Do Korean women like black men, um, Jin? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh okay. Oh, <laughs> I think if I say something and they will try to get ticket from now on, right? <laughs> uh, Korean, Korean women think black people are really sexy. They are so hot, especially their skin is like, how can I say? Like, like, like beautiful. Like, like they don't age, you know? Wow. Like. Yeah, we think like that. Mm. Like wow. we think, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. We think black people are really sexy and don't age, and they look attractive. Oh wow! Yeah, Incredible. yeah. <laughs> so... I'm not. Yeah, no cap. I'm not kidding. <laughs> no so, cap. Guys, from Korea. <laughs> so what? What? Bro, did that girl just say no cap? Oh my god, I'm dead, bruh. Wow. But hey, did y'all see that reaction? That was a genuine reaction, bro. They love us. I gotta get the hell. We gotta get the hell out of here, bruh. Oh my god. Mm -mm -mm -mm. And you know what? Now that I think about it, hey, um, anybody that watch, have any have any of y'all been in Korea? I really haven't heard anything about anybody saying anything about Korea. Um, I know guys, you know, say they've been to Thailand, Philippines. I think I've even heard some guys say they've been to Vietnam, um, Vietnam, Vietnam, however you pronounce it. Um, but I really haven't seen anybody say anything about Korea, man. So please, and if y'all know anything about Korea, let me know. What is that, Jin? Why do Korean women love black men? What is, sorry, I mean, what is the root? How did it start? Is it because of what you see on TV? Is it because you see educated black men like Idris Elba or oh. uh, Ben Carson? Ben Carson. Yeah, yeah, Ben Carson. Yeah. 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 So, is that? Do you like black men like that? Um, um, Jin, do you like do you like educated black men or do you like hip hop black men? <laughs> oh, actually, I really love hip hop so much, and then uh, like rap music or hip hop music, uh, most of the time came from like black people, right? Yes. So it helped us to uh, interested in black culture and black people too. Yeah, it helped us. And then, um, how can I say like rap music and hip hop music is so popular in Korea. Very, yeah, popular. very much. And then a lot of the K-pop hip-hop takes off with our hip-hop. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, so yeah, we, like, especially, yeah, Korean women and all of Korean, like, like, music. When I, when I first got here, I was, my uh, team, my admin team took me somewhere and, uh, Freaking, a bunch of Korean dudes came up to me and was like, they're like, like trying to hug me and stuff. And they're like, I wish I wish I was you. I wish I was black. It was funny. <laughs> it was funny. But yeah, they, you'll be welcome too. All right. Well, that 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 confirms, bro. Um, they 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 love the brothers, man. Even like even the, even the guys, man. The guys want to be us. Um, but you know what? I have noticed that um, I have noticed a lot of um, Asian rappers popping up lately, man. And a lot of their music sounds like ours. So once again, man, um, I think that's one of the reasons why black men are so appreciated in other countries, man. Because look how look how much we've influenced the world, bro. 
We've influenced the world. The world. But for some reason, we're scrutinized the most. For some reason, we're put under the microscope the most. Ain't that amazing? All right, well, hey, let me know what y'all think in the comments about this, man. Um, if y'all got any other suggestions, um, please let me know in the comments. All right, if you're new to the platform, please subscribe. OGs, I appreciate the love and support. Make sure y'all hit the bell notification so that way y'all know when I'm uploading. And hit the like button so it can reach a broader audience and help with the algorithm. Until the next video, y'all. Deuces.